bad. And capitalism is evil, right? Right? At least that's what we're told, and that's what Hollywood would have us believe. Corruption keeps us safe and warm. Corruption is why you and I are prancing around in here instead of fighting over scraps of meat out in the street. Corruption is why we win. But wait, are businesses really trying to rip off the little guy, or is that just one of the many myths Americans buy into? With us now is the host of Stossel on the Fox Business Network, John Stossel. Good morning, John. It is one of the myths. Well, it is and it isn't, and they are trying to rip off the little guy, but they can't succeed in America because we have competition, unlike government, which has no competition. And it took me too long to get this, but I won all these Emmy Awards as a local reporter bashing those corrupt businesses. But when I got to Good Morning America, I was surprised, where are the big national scams? And I finally woke up to the point that they self-correct. You know, there's Bernie Madoff, there's Enron, but they are very rare. They are the exception because word gets out. The good companies thrive. The way to get really rich in America is to serve your customers well. The bad ones go away. Compared to government, when the Interior Department loses $3 billion of the Indians' money, they just go back to Congress and say, oops, we need $3 billion. And so, Congress gives it to them. So who benefits most from the business is bad, capitalism is evil argument? Well, big government, because we're now going to regulate business. But I also think it's intuitive. The public believes it. They're out for profit. Government's out to help us. But motives don't matter. It's results that matter. And Would business you stop serves... making sense? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't come that, here and make that sense. That line actually really made a lot of sense. Um, all right, so, so now the next myth that you're going to debunk tonight on your show has to do with water. And we all know that in the last decade or so, bottled water is all the rage, right? And I think you're going to make uh, Mike and I test some out here. Well, have a test here. We have two bottled, and... But you're not telling us which I'm is I'm not which. telling you which. All right. Take Chin -chin. a Here's a third oh, choice, sorry. and see what you like. But people, I've done these taste tests where people say, I only drink bottled water, and we give them the taste test, and they don't like their preferred bottled, bottled water. Do you want to sip out of mine? Tap. I, like, do you have a certain <laughs> No, I, I'll put mine there. Okay, we have I to have share to, here. We have, we have to share. We share like everything around here. Kids don't do this at home. All right. Okay, this favorites? Is, this, is, yeah. this is tap. Okay. Um, I'm saying this is tap. Okay, and which do you like? Um, I like this one. No, I take it back. This is tap. <laughs> Who's my list? <laughs> Neither. Uh, this is tap. You were right. Look Very at that. Good. Right. Oh. This is Aquafina, which is tap water, which is, re which is filtered tap water, sometimes from the Detroit River. Wow. That you and pay three bucks for. That you pay three bucks for. And the, and the other one's also bottled. Yes. This is Poland Springs. You guys didn't like that. Well, sorry. John, is it truth or myth that, um, that tap water, the water coming out of that tap, is actually more regulated in terms of what's in it than bottled water? They're barely regulated, and they're both safe. They all have tiny traces of these horrible chemicals that people are saying, oh, we're going to cause all kinds of problems. Right. But they're at such low levels that tap water, bottled right. water, you're just wasting water, your money. Tap water might be good for kids, too, because it has fluoride in it. Mm -hmm. uh, John, good to see you. Everyone will watch your show tonight on the Fox Business Network. At midnight. Oh, woo, unfortunately. Right. Okay, thanks very much. Coming up on the show, Nate.